So why this is going to be a little different from this morning is... This is going to slightly put me in a slightly different key and make me think differently. So this is going to be an F sharp mixolydian here. It's going to force me to think in G mixolydian. concepts I'm going to be working on are phrases, singable and melodic things that sound good to my ear, that are just kind of cool, and so that's going to give us a couple of different options that we can go with melodically right away, and that is a leap followed by a resolution in the opposite direction, so I go, or it's something like, we do it the opposite way. And, and, and honestly, it's, it's always good to do, if you do a leap, to resolve it in the opposite direction. for a little motive that I can start to play on and, and I think that should just be our motive for now and then I'm going to look to play it in different octaves and in order to get to those different octaves I'm actually going to shred scales and when I shred scales I don't just go straight to the scale I tend to uh, vary up the pattern in, in just different kinds of ways that just absolutely f that actually feel good don't necessarily always go for the sound, so, um, but I'm kind of like, really digging that. Alright, so let's, let's see if we can throw that little motive in there a couple of times, and then, um, actual F sharp. On this we can kind of put arpeggio pairs together since we are in this sort of G mix line. So we're gonna it'll work well with F and honestly when I when the first thing I think of when I think of arpeggio pairs is kind of taking these three middle strings of these chords here. So like F G F And then I'm going to vary up the picking pattern and do something like this. One more time. Hit the right chords. So 
So, uh, and honestly, I'm going to use a little sweeping motion there. Down, 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 down
it just doesn't really stop for like a good one and a half minutes and so it's a good skill anyway. it's really not a whole lot of artistic or musical merit to it I don't think and it gets old really quick for our listeners um, but I just kind of want to show that it does take an immense amount of practice to keep up with it keep, just be able to keep it under your finger So, and, you know, before we really kind of kill this and get into some walking, and uh, I'm, I'm pretty exhausted from this week, to be honest with you, it's that uh, real life has just been um, trying to get all the uh, garden and everything together, and then it's work, end of the month is always crazy, so it's, uh, it's glad that, it, I'm happy it's June, but uh, yeah, I think in it, Ann and I hit the ground pretty deflated <laughs> for June. <laughs> So uh, let's talk about some of these lyrics for a little bit. We've got, basically we've got three songs going. So if you've been following along for the last week or so, we've got a couple of really uh, solid kind of musical ideas down and maybe the third one's a little iffy, but um, you know, we were just kind of screwing around this morning, just coming up with ideas, trying to get stuff out of our out of our brain, you know. Uh, at least that's the way I got to do it. So I'm not actually going to add any lyrics. I'm not going to do any... Uh, melodic or vocal stuff with this today. Uh, I do know that uh, for the one rock song, let me just kind of pull these up so we can kind of refresh our memory here. So the one that's sort of Satriani, I'm, I'm trying to think if any of these are actually in, uh, I think the, I think we're all down a, a half step here. So um, this, this one, I don't, I, it started instantly to take like a southern kind of rock direction. That's, that's my fault. That's my voice. I can't get away from, you know, Hardy har 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 singing, but I don't want this song to be about the South. I kind of like to be tongue in cheek about manipulating people, and um, and I've got I've got this really great line. I'm trying to think of what it is. I have it written down on my phone, but it's about um, I don't I don't need to convince you of anything. I just want to whisper in your ear like this kind of thing, and so that's that's sort of what this song is going to be about. And I'll just have to sit on the lyrics for a little bit, but. Let's just go ahead and get a recap because I think we got a really killer kind of solo gallon here. Definitely on the uh, um, kind of Satriani side things here. So thank you if you follow me. I really appreciate it. If you're watching right now, thank you so much. If you're seeing this on YouTube, make sure that you uh, like and subscribe. Turn that down just a bit.
Uh, pretty cool, right? So, um, go back and just check out any of the songwriting streams that started about a week ago, and you can watch me write that in real time. I mean, it's not... It's not a masterpiece, but it's pretty cool. I could I could dig that. It makes me want to get out and drive my car, ride my motorcycle. It makes me want to buy a motorcycle so I could ride it, listen to the song, you know, that kind of thing. Maybe wind sailing. I don't know. I'm not a wind sailor. Ah, uh, but cool. Happy with it. You know, that's and that's all that really counts is that you got to be you got to like what you're doing here. Um, got our second one, which is hilarious and I know that people are gonna complain about the lyrics blah 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 yeah it's maybe silly but think about what we're doing here just for a second all right you know I'm gonna I'll, I'll walk you through what I got so we kind of know what this song sounds like country rock all right no doubt about it From the mountains to the Delta land from the mountains to the Delta land yeah dog Sun burns down on the sand. Cook the soul. Cook the soul. No Alright, it's just as dumb as you might think this is, and I'm not in love with these lyrics, but just think about what I'm doing here, okay? I'm not telling a story. I'm just painting a picture. I'm showing something, and that's what really matters here. And I think that's what you want to do with good music. Good, they, they don't they tell a story yeah but they show they show the pictures and in your mind you're thinking about the sound you hear this country is from the mountains to the delta land what the hell does that mean well I mean in the south we got the Mississippi Delta really well known everybody knows what that is so we got we're talking about rivers we're talking about mountains put these images in your mind and then it gives you a really good imagery sun burning down on the sand so yeah we got beaches and desert and all that other stuff too and I like, it's all kind of there, and I'm just showing what the salad is, all right? And so, uh, now, here comes the real kind. We cook we cook with soul. Soul food. I mean, it's there, right? We do. We cook with soul. I, 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 it may not sound cool, but it's the truth. <laughs> and then, we got what? Uh, we, we, lo we love with pride. You know, I mean... We do. We're proud people, and uh, but I do. I feel like in the South, there's a lot of love down here. This is, but it's silly, but it works. Okay, now keep going. In the land of the fried country fried. Okay, now there's definitely the dumbest line. In the land of the fried and country fried. Now, I'm sorry, but. We do fry everything down here, and then we country fry everything down here as well. So, if this song is going to be about the South, I don't know how you're going to not talk about the fried food. Now, you may think it's dumb, and I'm not, like I said, I'm not in love with it, but I'm talking about the South. And then we're not writing a masterpiece here. I'll get to that in just a second. One more. Living in the South is a way of life. That's true. Living in the South is a way of life. Arguable. I don't know. Alligators. At least they're not man eaters, right? And out there is something beautiful about the bayou. We got the bayou down here in Texas and in Louisiana and all that. So now, what what I want to say is, lyrics can all think about parody lyrics. Okay, it's just you're you're sipping in words. They, it could have totally different meaning, but it's going to have sort of the same rhythm and all that stuff. So it's very easy to exchange words and lyrics and all that stuff. What is not easy to do is work them out into a song. So a lot of people, a lot of young people, lot of but budding songwriters who you know think they're going to make it big, like we all do. You know, but if you want to write songs, you want to be successful, don't sit on those lyrics. Don't wait for the golden lyrics. Don't wait for the perfect song and all that because you ain't going to write it. What's going to end up happening? If you ever do get those lyrics, you still got to work them out. You still got a ton of work to do. So you might as well have everything worked out and then just pop everything in, like, you know, because there's a certain way some of us have to do things. And I think that this is a kind of a smart way to look at it. So, um, 
You know, when it comes to just when it comes to writing lyrics, don't force it. And that's what I'm not going to do today. Like, I, I like where this is going, but I didn't come up with anything that I think is cool. I got about a page of stuff, wrote it down, put it in a text, sent it to myself. I don't really like anything, so I'm not going to force it. I'm just going to, I'm going to sleep on this, and tomorrow, when I wake up, maybe in the morning stream, or maybe in the afternoon stream, I'm going to have something cool, you know. But for now, that's the other thing. When it comes to lyric writing, don't force stuff, you know. None of us are really making a living doing this, so there's no reason to, to you know. But at the same time, that said, you don't, you don't want to sit on ideas thinking that you're going to make it rich and all this other. I've seen it a million times. And, you know, and, and if you've ever tried to write a song or if you've written a song, you know what I'm talking about. Especially if you get it recorded and produced, which is a whole other stream and a bunch of other streams we're talking about about why you should never go to a recording studio, why you should never get your music produced by someone else. Learn how to do it yourself. It's not that big a deal. But thank you for the follow. I do appreciate it. That is uh, when we get excited, we get a follower. So that is, uh, just, just so you know, that's our uh, follower on our page. And then I guess we'll come out a little bit. All right, but yeah, and then it will come. So really that's all I want to say about that and then um, tomorrow we'll sort of pick up with the one little fast tune that we started this morning and then we'll see if we can get some other ideas going and then we'll have a good time. So what I'm about to do now is go set up for our walk and stream, get some exercise in if you guys want to join me. It's just going to be relaxing, just kind of peaceful in the backyard, chilling. And uh, again, thank you for the follow, thank you for watching and uh more music in the morning and then tonight i think ann and i will be streaming some gaming stuff so we'll get that up but let's go ahead get ready and uh feel free to join me basically all i'll be doing back here is reading walking sweating meditating just relaxing i've got a really beautiful backyard and we've been working really hard today and so it's, it's time to relax before we get to do our uh, uh, four o'clock round of uh uh, another three hours or so of uh, working and then um, we'll get to that seven o'clock stream so thank you so much for following and uh, it's hard to see is it oh, okay yeah absolutely thank you thank you so much for following thank you for being here and uh, we'll be back with know, all kinds of stuff always be excellent to each other and party on hang out for a few minutes and we'll be in the backyard